Imagine a world where people suffering from cancer can avoid invasive procedures, simply taking the exact molecules that they need to fight their illness. Imagine patients are able to take this medication by themselves in the comfort of their own home. At EPFL, Professor Guiducci is working on just this sort of treatment, a device which brings together the fields of electronics and life sciences. In this laboratory, we are using a combination of highly advanced biological techniques with micrometric and nanometric sensors, which give us really, really precise signals. The aim is to develop systems for a new generation of blood analysis, which could help personalize medicine, to determine the appropriate treatment on the one hand, but also to follow up on this treatment. Next stop, the University Hospital of Lausanne, where doctors will explain how Professor Guiducci's invention will simplify diagnostics and medication dosage. Donc ici, vous êtes au laboratoire de pharmacologie clinique. Welcome to the Laboratory of Clinical Pharmacology. Our expertise is in the dosage of medication in the blood of patients. We are all different when it comes to medication. Some metabolize quickly, others more slowly, and we can optimize the tolerance profile and the efficiency of a medicine by adjusting the dosage according to the concentration of the blood. This system is able to measure the concentrations of drugs in blood samples directly and it allows to display in real time the results. The arrival of miniaturized devices of this kind that are available to the medical practice of the polyclinic will allow us to democratize monitoring of the concentration of medication. Instead of having to send samples to big laboratories with the inevitable waiting list, the doctor will have the results directly on their screen. These will be immediately translated by an appropriate algorithm into the appropriate dosage for the patient, who will receive the doses of medication which are most likely to expose them to a concentration which is neither too strong and therefore toxic, nor too low and ineffective. Thanks to the work of Professor Guiducci and to the personalization of medicinal treatments, electronics applied to the life sciences could, in the near future, avoid the discomfort of terrible side effects.